ass, face off, bitch. Y'all are one nutter. F-O. F-O, be the number one gunner. We all lock it down, hold a court in your town. F-O, hell is lyricist. I treat rap like a one way, stay in your lane, used to be unpaid. Smoke Black be running game. That's why I don't respect him. It's like you like getting shitted on. This nigga Odell Beckham, you false, eh? Wanna be the boss? Well, here's the cost, pay. And I may address this bitch, but I ain't got no time for cosplay. Get your shit rock. I let off a small clip. That's a tick. Talk, I'll bum a cigarette, then drop the single on him and make his hip hop. He probably walk around right now with some thongs on. And they ain't no flip flops. I'll pull up quick like I'm running a race and give him a pit stop. Some people call him Smoke Black, but I have black smoking. Cause when the fire starts, he better get low to the ground and end up on his back choking. I'm back focused. This nigga whack bogus. I'll show up every year to eat his food and fuck up his growth. It's like I'm half locust. This nigga, I own my fade. I'm ready to start my first day of barber school. I'll brush him off with the chopper. Then finish up with the blade, my rage. I can't wait to see the day I dig him up from his grave just to body him again, just in case he got saved. Oh my God. So get your team in line before I start reaching nine. Cause when these hands go past 730, we really gonna be on demon time. Psh, slime. I want all the smoke. Support a fighter. Don't forget to donate to California. Cause when I run in, everything's blazing. Here comes the forest fire. I really wet you, but I'm not here to rescue. After the coroner releases this body, your fam will be here to get you. Forget you. Baby daddy, guess what? What's up, yeah? HD just called. Mike Main, you already know what you gotta do. Get the writing. <laughs> Smoke black versus ah oh, shit. Have a seat, folks. It's just you again. Truthfully, Mike, man, you need some newer friends. This not even a good matchup. I done beat you already, folks. This shit uneven. This shit about to be a straight disappointment like the Ravens Super Bowl run last season, but I'm going to run all over you still just to get you out this bracket. It don't matter what my energy is, fuck nigga. You can't match it. When I left face off, you and Ammo was acting like some fatherless bastards. Like, I ain't teach y'all. When we all was battling that city of gods, I used to pack it. Shame on you, nigga. Been around all these years, still ain't got no game about you, nigga. Small shit don't excite me. I ain't never been the type that like to flash money. Couple shooters with me. Bunch of certified crash dummies. You gonna take what? Nothing but this ass whooping to keep it moving. I'm still slept on in this league. Well, 40 gonna make sure we keep it snoozing. Call that alarming. This full core press gonna show y'all D nice. Mac acronym manipulate all cowards. I bet he paid D price. Hit his moms up like bitch. How much is it worth to you for D life? Everybody want a piece of the pot. You about to get D slice. Think it's a game. To your next battle when John Hopkins. Thank old school jazz. Whatever I pick, they roll on like John Stockton. Now let's get it poppin'. This was some bread, so it's off with his head. This nigga dead on some rat shit. You going to the shooting range showing off your guns and shit on some flat shit. Well, what's next, bitch? I see you got a nice arsenal, well. The war now. I advise you go front line and stop acting like a whore, clown. Mac, bitch! Fuck everything he said he'd be. 
Bitch, you ain't no pedigree. Plus, everything you be on is small shit with the rest of fleas. Bitch, you like the Paw Patrol. Get your pussy ass wet when my dogs get on the roll. This entanglement with the Wesson will have the Smith hitting on all your goals. da da di da da do When I kidnap your mom, you'll be making reservations to give Papa dough. Bring the check or I'll pop the hoe. That bread better be sitting on the table before I ch ch Lock and load. Smoke black, you're one of the ugliest motherfuckers I've seen in my goddamn life. Now keep in mind that I've seen HD go live and full screen on Skype. Every battle you ever won was all off hype. And a dirty pair of shell tops was the last time you walked with stripes. You fake fraudulent foe for gazy, my bro. So I suggest that you watch the throne like Jay-Z and yo. I don't care which card he be. I'll wear a pussy for show. You punk bastard, you. I hope they name the next hurricane after you. I hope your kids show up late to all their virtual classes too. I hope when he takes a COVID test, he just barely passes. I hope you get audited for the past six years of your taxes. I hope you drop your smartphone and smash the gorilla glass into fractions. I hope every day you wake up, you throw up some thug passion. I'm an assassin. I'll whip your ass then. I hope the hard drive you have for Pro Tools just starts crashing. I hope the next time you're about to get head, she starts laughing. Nigga, you bitch, you can flow me. I don't really even have to write up an OT. You probably blew off the whole battle in your house about the OD. But just in case your rounds ghost written from home, me, I'ma show how this crackhead's as genuine as the nigga that sang Pony. You motherfucking phony. Baby daddy. Baby daddy. Baby daddy. <laughs> hey, I'm about done with dinner. You about ready? Hey, give me a little second, man. I got a little bit left. Second round. I done already barked on you, nigga. Told HD put you on the other side of the card. I really ain't want to talk to you, nigga. He said, nah, nah. This lead just as much a part of you, nigga. Smoke black, you done fell off. And since you been gone, these niggas ain't bringing no fans in. It's because of that right there, Mike, man. I'm about to take this walk with you, nigga. Congratulations, good brother. These past couple years, I had saying your elevation, but see, your sickness like flu. Mine's COVID, translation. Currently, there's no medication. In other words, bitch nigga, you curable. Nigga gonna ask me why my gun's so small. Cause real shooters don't need all them shots, and revolvers more durable. I'm like a whiz. I always knew Mike was a weirdo. But if he don't get on down the road, he'll be stuck in the field with birds like a scarecrow. Get on down the road, Mike, where it's scare... Never mind. I was going to bring it back. But that just mean you ain't say it right if you got to explain every line. Nigga, when you rap and be taking shots and shit, nigga, your bullets must be protected with nerf pads. I really be fucking niggas up, waking up the next day praying and asking for forgiveness like twerk crash. This ass woman gon' kinda hurt bad. Cause you're not a bad guy, you're just a bad rapper. See, some niggas can be good hustlers, but they bad trappers. This a sequel through the looking glass. I'm a mad hatter, kill you, the LOL at the funeral. I'm a bad actor, you fake ass shotter, which I'ma call it Marley. Been rapping all these years, but no one never leaves Harley. After this, you getting cut off, like the gas and electric when you don't pay that. See, you a clown, homie. I seen the live and low color. I don't play that. Mac, bitch. Yo, JR Slander. I just watched um, Smoke Black and Mike Main. 
Um, I've seen these two before. Uh, these two guys are both very dope. Um, and I think I've judged battles of theirs before. So anyway, um, coming out the gate, Smoke Black has the setup where he's thinking this whole thing in his head. And it's like this passive voice thing. And I thought that was really dope. Again, like in the COVID video battle shit. I think that particular approach is dope and I, it is worth points with me. Like, I don't know what the rules are to judging, but with me, that's worth points because, you know, it's just more exciting than talking into a camera um, blatantly. Anyway, um, I guess my criticism what what Smoke did was that like, you know, I, it just a lot of the specific lines didn't jump off the page for me. Um, although I, I really appreciated the format and he had that like laid back arsenal style. And I thought that was dope because, you know, I'm from Jersey. Um, Mike, what he did was a little more direct and, um, he just like overemphasized punches, but said everything with a lot of feeling and conviction. Um, I thought his first was punch heavy and I thought the, I hope stuff in the second was really dope cause he got disrespectful and that's the kind of stuff that I really appreciate in battle rap. So I think the way I'm going to view it is just that I, I preferred Mike's verses, um, both first and second, um, you know, I wouldn't be mad like seeing an OT or seeing these guys battle live at some point. But, um, yeah, I just prefer what Mike was doing. And, uh, you know, no hate to Smoke. Smoke was dope, too. Uh, but, yeah, I got Mike taking one and two. Shout out Face Off. It's Quan Bell. This is my pick for the Smoke Black versus Mike Main Battle round two of the tournament. For the first round, it was definitely, uh, definitely a solid round between both of them. I had to edge it to... Smoke Black, though, just off creativity alone. I feel like it was both even in bars as far as that went, but how Smoke delivered that, doing that with the audio, implementing his lady and everything, chilling, writing. So that was, that was very unique for me. That was, that was different. And I like how he pulled that off. And Mike Main, he had a solid round. The only thing that took away from him for me was that he was sitting down and it just seemed like he was lax, you feel me? And maybe that's what he wanted to do. It was just like, man, I can just sit down and bar him up and get him out of here, you feel me? And he could have, but Smoke came with that unique style of delivery to give him, like, for his round for this one live shit. So, you know, that was different. I had to give him points for that. And for the second round, I had to give it to Mike Man Clear. I felt like um, with Smoke, it was really unique how he's given these rounds for an online tournament. But I was hoping he did something different in the second round. Instead of, you feel me, the same format he did for the first. I feel like he still had nice bars and everything, but then it seemed kind of run on just how he was doing it. And I feel like Mike Main schemes, some, you know, his punches, his repetitive loop that he was doing, it, it was definitely fire. Definitely had some funny, clever bars in there. So overall, I had to say it's an OT, you know, and good luck to whoever continues to go forward. Yo, know, coming back to you live, Troy Brown. Um, technical difficulties had to reshoot my judgment for this round. Uh, but yeah, round one, Smoke Black, Mike Mang. It was a great battle. Um, I gave I gave round one to Smoke Black, you know what I mean? I dug smoke creativity, you know what I mean? Uh I, and I really dug like the concept, you know what I'm saying, coming in with the instead of saying your round, kind of like thinking the round out loud, you know what I mean? Like I dug how he came in with that. Um, yeah, man, good battle, but my round one went to Smoke Black. Peace. Face Off Battle League, this is Troy Brown coming in, round two, Judgment, Smoke Black versus Mike Main. Good battle, man. I got to get this one to Mike Main on, on round two. Uh, yo, Mike really, Mike went crazy, you know what I'm saying? Like, I thought Smoke did what he do, but I, I think that Smoke kind of took his foot off the gas a little bit. Mike Main, on the other hand, man, he ramped it up. You know what I'm saying? I, I thought that that was one of the, probably the best rounds I ever heard from him. I liked even the way he was putting it together, the words, you know, with the applied pressure to the wound, like the way he was kind of pausing the lines and like he was really he was really rapping. You know what I'm saying? He was really doing his thing and he kind of ended it with the Mike Main, no cap, like the crazy, you know what I'm saying? You know Mike Main style. But uh, hell yeah, man, good ass battle. I need to see OT face off. Bars. Baby daddy. Baby daddy. Yeah. Man, I thought you said you was done, about done. My HD just hit me up and said shit three rounds now, not two. 
Just give me 10 minutes, man. This shit be over. Alright. I was born down Murphy Homes, but raised in pig town. Bitch, I'm from the hood. If any altercation was the trans finger in the nose, it's not the pick of bugs, see. I ain't come to explain a damn thing misunderstood. I'm the most slept on from this league. Up until this 20 shit been all good, but see. This round I sneeze to make sure the Lord bless it. I'm really gangster. This ain't a disease, you can't catch it. As a youngin', mama said when it's beef, it is what it is. Better not stress it, cause niggas gotta stend those and play for keeps. My response was, mama, mine's only curry six. She said, well, baby, I hope you can stretch it. I said, mama, you know I'm gangsta. I base my life off the six. Besides, anybody could be a shooter. Strikes on the arm when somebody get hit. This tourney ain't even about y'all. This shit was just to show my progression. HD said, I know you can beat the whole roster, but can you win a tournament while teaching each nigga a lesson? For me, battle rap a obsession. Y'all remember back in the day when we battled on corners not giving a fuck if our rounds got talked through? Matter of fact, back in the day, battling on them corners, niggas like this clown wouldn't even walk through. I'm still trying to make this make sense. They ain't want me here, I could take hints. HD said I got a stack for you, so I decided to come home just to go beast mode, Marshawn Lynch. I'm a real DMV goonie, but I never met twerk. I know some jack boys that's some riders for low nothing they put in work. He tried to hide in the cave, not knowing I put glue on young cannon, so next time he posted on the ad, my ace can do damage. Nigga, this a dope strip. Around here, you can't twerk rock besides. You're not the right chef for them drugs. That stepped on, gonna get you murk. Ah, King David on my chest, that's what it is, folk. I ain't never fuck with gangs. I just hung around the beds, folk. Y'all watching this shit that don't know me? Big GD with this is, folk. You dealing with a nerd that could really give two fucks. I'll teach him a lesson when bullets go inside his body, just like the magic school bus. I'm defaming this kid's reputation. Just call me JR Slander. The CCTV seen the hammer. Who knew the candid camera? My boys will hunt you down in the storm for fronting, just like Homelander. I'll be cursing over the body. I'm part necromancer. All that dickhead shit you said prior gets no answer. This is your life calling. I'll put the fire on him like JoJo Dance. Say so keep playing games with me, son. You don't know how much on tools spent. I ain't gonna hold you, but I run up with a new controller. That's sort of like dual sense. Watch how you speaking before I start geeking with the soldiers. I put two black holes in his chest. The size of Cardi B's areolas. Now you leak him because you thought you were impressive as a goon. But now you laying on the ground screaming for someone to apply pressure to the wounds. I've been battle rap long enough to see the environment raised. So it ain't surprising. And the temperatures rising Nigga, this climate changed I never thought I'd see T-Rex become extinct Damn, I know that I have aged But they gonna think it's fossils on the ground By the time they finally find your grave I'm a menace to society <laughs> Like Furious, boy I'll chase you around the city with banana clips Like Curious George I'll run up in your crib Bearing arms to eat your food Like locks filling the porch For thinking you king I'll get you aired out When I peel out with a sword Your family gonna be in the waiting room Trying to decide the day to pull out the cord Cause you thought to having YouTube in the mouth was an Amount you could afford so all the views you getting now is from your peoples bowing down praying that you get approved by the Lord so hold that I told you black you gonna catch an L for that old match I want all the smoke like take the what leader what I'm the top shot of a face off and that's no cap What up, face off? Uh, JR Slander. Just watched the overtime of uh, Smoke Black and Mike Main. Uh, really enjoyed the first two rounds from both of these guys. Uh, familiar with both of these guys and their, um, you know, talented dudes. Um, just getting into it, uh, Smoke Black did the uh, conversation in his mind thing again, which was dope. Uh, talking to his baby mom. I, you know, I don't know. Maybe just that particular piece uh, was intriguing. Uh, you know, good, good, solid round. I think he went kind of with like the real talk angle 
and uh, in thirds, that can be very effective. I uh, liked what he was doing. Um, just kind of solid throughout. Um, and Mike kind of stayed aggressive. He stayed punchy. Um, Smoke Black picked up his punches a little bit, I thought. Um, and that, I did, that was something I noticed. Um, I caught the shout out from Mike in the, in the verse, which is always appreciated. Um, I just think he finished a little bit stronger. I think Mike Main kind of got to it and, um, stayed a little bit more direct and finish just, just this much stronger. I, I almost feel like it's preference, and I feel like I've been saying that for all three rounds, and that just goes to show you kind of how kind of close this is, and, it, you know, these two guys know what they're doing. So uh, I'm going with Mike Main in the overtime also, but, you know, Smoke Black did his thing, and, I you know, I wouldn't be mad if somebody said that he got it. I just think Mike, you know, edged it by a little bit. All right, peace. Uh, just want to say shout-out to both of y'all. Um, for the overtime period, I'm just mad because I don't want to have to be the reason one of y'all possibly get eliminated because for I fuck with both rounds and I really wish that it was a way that y'all could both make it through because I like the component both of y'all had. I think with Mike Main, he focused more on the raps and even though his performance was light, his bars were strong and Smoke's performance was strong, but I just feel like the bars were a little light, even with the good idea he had. Uh, for the overtime period, I guess I'm gonna have to decide to give it to. I'm gonna have to give it to Mike May, just off the bars alone, because I am interested to see what Smoke would have had. Like, just another one of these clever ideas as far as with his footage. So I'm salty. Like, maybe I give it to Smoke, you know. I don't know. I really don't want to choose neither one of y'all niggas. I want both of y'all niggas to make it through. I mean, this shit for $1,000. Mike Main, nigga, you better stand up and rap. I'm going to take Mike Main, but stand the fuck up. Because it would have been clear for me if you just did that shit. I feel like Smoke, his first round was fire, especially with the idea. But with the second and third, I just the bars had to be crazy if he was just going to sit there like that. And at least your bars was fire. So I'm going to give it to Mike Main. Face off Battle League, Troy Brown, tuning in, checking in. I just now finished uh watching Mike Main, um Mike Main and Smoke Black, uh OT. Man, that was crazy. I gotta go with Mike Main. Um I thought Smoke did his thing. I thought the intro on Smoke Verse was crazy. I thought the uh the finger to the nose for the book, that was a crazy bar. I like that one. Um I like the intro, I like how he how he kind of broke it down, went through the story on him, you know, taught the lesson. That was, I liked the angle, but at the same time, man, uh, you know, I had to give it to Mike. I thought bar wise, I thought Mike went to a whole nother level. You know what I'm saying? I think that that's probably the best round I've seen from him. You know, he had to, he had to go in, you know what I'm saying? I thought the, the YouTube, then the mouth bar was crazy. Um, you know, the, the apply pressure to the wound, like, you know, he was really going in and then he did the whole, you know what I'm saying? The no cap, which was, uh, <laughs> in classic Mike main fashion, you just staring at the screen crazy as hell. Like, I don't know, man. Mike main, man, he went to another level on that one. I got to go with Mike, man. Damn. Good ass battle, man. I wish I could go with another OT, but nah, Mike, the bro, he went crazy on that one, man. Peace. Face off, nigga!